Following up tonight, investigators in Shasta County are still looking for answers in the Sherry Papini case. It seems everywhere they go, they're striking out, but that isn't putting a damper on the community's joy. NBC 5's R. Barron tells us more. The holiday weekend didn't include a break for investigators hoping to find out what happened to Sherry Papini. The young mother found Thanksgiving morning after her disappearance three weeks before. New release dispatch tapes paint a picture of her condition. Investigators are now looking for two Hispanic women in a dark SUV. Saturday, they reviewed surveillance video from this church, the closest building to where Papini was found. Church members say there wasn't much to see. Did they find anything? No, they didn't find anything. While investigators remain tight-lipped over the case, the community is still celebrating Papini's return. Hallelujah! <laughs> Best thing ever. Best Thanksgiving. Reading Mayor Missy MacArthur spoke with the Papinis over the holiday weekend. She says the couple is thankful. Sherry and Keith called me to say thanks for the community's help, and I feel blessed that they accept that the community was there for them. And she wants to pass that thanks on to everyone who helped bring Sherry home. I just want to thank the community for not giving up. Keith never gave up hope, and that was an inspiration to me and I'm sure to the community. Art Barron reporting, investigators still haven't released a possible motive for the kidnapping or the reason why Papini was dropped off. At this point, it does not appear her release was financially motivated.